Darlington, did this game feel similar to the past two games, at least up until they scored that second goal in terms of chance creation, but you guys not being able to find that first goal to take the lead? Yeah, I would say so. You know, uh, prior to games, past couple of games, you know, I think we've been doing well. Creating chances, been in a couple of positions, you know, uh, when we pick up the first goal. You know, we usually continue the right things uh, more times than none. Things work out in your favor, so a lot of games left and continue to what we're doing. What's it going to take to I guess just not allow that first goal. It just seems like that was their first real chance that they had, and that's kind of been the case the last few games. Yeah, I mean, you know, for me, I think you need a little bit of luck, you know. It's cheap hit, that sounds corny, if that sounds. We're doing all the right things, you know. I don't know how many chances they had. I think maybe two, you know, and they got two goals mm -hmm. coming to the other game. So, I think continue, continue to do what we're doing, stay right mentally, focus on the positives, you know. Just little things to improve, and, you know, if they're not major, and like I said, more, more, more. More times than not, when you do the right things, you'll get rewarded. And focusing on the positive, like, is, is that a little more difficult just given it's the third straight loss, albeit mm -hmm. this is, you know, what you could argue is mm -hmm. one bad performance of these three games here? Yeah, it is, it is tough, like you said, third loss in the row, you know, but for me, you'd rather, you know, rather not come at all, but if they are going to come earlier in the season, the better, you know, and then we can finish off the season strong, so. Like I said, I'm um, confident in the boys, the coaching staff, this team, this club. Uh, we have the players, we're capable, we'll continue to go. Thanks for the time, Darlington. Coach was talking about uh, psychology of the team and how um, losing like this does get into the psyche of some players, uh, especially with kind of the younger folks on the team or newer players to the team. What do you say to somebody like a very who's had a tough stretch over the last few matches or somebody else who doesn't have like the same experience what do you impart on them to kind of help flip that psychology uh, just continue to rely on us you know the guys that have been playing for a while uh, rely on us you know especially me myself and i always tell the guys it's a long season it's a long season and things are always up and down you know if it's perfect the whole way then usually it doesn't end up pretty good so you need the ups and downs to have a successful season we're just going through it right now and Orlando came in today, and Coach mentioned it too, coming in with the defensive mindset, kind of how uh, Nashville played uh, a couple weeks ago and how uh, you folks played against Philadelphia also. Um, what do you see within the side that can turn things around for the crew and be able to maybe break through those defenses that are coming at you or kind of sitting back a little further now that I think teams are seeing that this is a way that we can slow them down? Finishing touches, you know, finishing, finishing touches, execution uh, in the final third, you know, and when I say final third, it's just not that, it's not always that attacking group. You know, midfielders can get a little higher up, up the field, uh, outside backs can get higher up the field, so we're all in there, and I think all of us have had opportunities, so we got to be more clinical with them. Like I said, it's not just the attacking thing, not just the defending thing, it's the whole team. Thank you. Starting to, as you said, it's early in the season, mm -hmm. but after a third straight loss, I'm sure there's some fans who were thinking about last season's kind of midsummer swing you guys were on. Why with this group will that not happen? Why why will you guys not repeat what happened last year? I think the performances have been different. You know, if I'm remembering correctly, uh, so far this year we've been in great attacking positions. You know, we've had the better of all the games. In my opinion, we should still be undefeated. You know, if not top of the league. So, you know, maybe I'm being naive, but I do believe we're we're a great team, if not one of the best teams. So, I keep that mindset. Believe in myself, believe in my teammates, and I'm going to continue to do what I can do. So, yeah. Thanks, Good. Thanks, Thank you, Darrell. Thank you, guys.